Jesse. Jordan. What is happening in your life? You mm, still you still wearing this Jesse? Yeah. Okay. All right. Now we wear the Jesse not to support Black Stars, to do but what? To, the laugh, fashion. to laugh at them. To laugh at them. Yes. Eh? Oh, okay. But as Black Stars do make lucky for Afcon, lucky as they make, I tell you, say, bro, when you daily giveaway, like, uh, uh, draw a raffle, you feel enter and win daily giveaways, like, you know, fridge, you go feel win laptops, you go feel win motorcycles and things, you understand? The grand draw is 30th of November. But before the grand draw will come, you know, every day you go feel win something, you go feel win cash prizes and things. So if for that, star 712 hash or visit www.theluckiestafrica.com, you understand? If for partake in something like this, you understand? Mm. You know, they need fridge. So the grand draw will come, but before you go come, you go fill in cash, you go fill in fridge, you go fill in laptop. Every day it happen. We'll them so things. be part of this. Once again, you for that star seven one two hash. Star seven one two hash or www.theluckiestafrica.com uh, and stand a chance of you know be part of this lottery and stand a chance of winning your know, fridge, laptop, TV. Um, grand you know draw no is happening on the thirtieth of November. Be part of this. Conversation. Why uh, you black stars and you're lucky? I know means you for not be lucky. Yeah, yes, for you for be lucky in your life. For be lucky. Yes. Forget lucky. about black stars. Yeah, dog get them. But yes, the black stars of Ghana. Yeah. We are still on their neck. Yes. Oh, they thought we. Uh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait a minute. They thought we were finished. You can't waste our time for ninety minutes and we will nah, take nah, dash. Nah, you nah, know, nah, everybody nah. go collecting one. Bro, yesterday them them the way them cook to Ado, eh, the journalist. Some journalists busy and say, Oh yes, are you a scout or you a coach? We say we do we be coach for twelve years. So, so he scouting who is the coach? Months. Life coach or what? So he say he be coach. He be coach. Yeah, for, with twelve years experience. This is what we can get. And if you watch the press conference after the game yesterday, Sheldon, mm -hmm. I can boldly tell you that. Mm -hmm. They forced him to do the work. Okay. He's not a coach material. I say what is your video? 12 years of coaching, 12 years of coaching, and six months of, of scouting. Now I'll ask you, what am I? And during the scouting also I was coaching. I was not, I never stopped. What, what am I? Well, then I think you scouting is better than you coaching. Okay. So, you are okay. good at scouting than coaching. Okay, okay. Because okay. in coaching, you are not good at all. Okay. Like what bread or Lisa Pippan in him? No, he say how could they do this? You know what? Uh, that be the difference between him and um the one that um the the light skin man was uh, Chris Hutton. Chris Hutton. You see, Otoado has terrible media training. Like. <laughs> He's so terrible when it comes to communicating to the media. You see, as a coach, things like this go happen. You understand? You for calm situation. <laughs> but the coach, you don't get to you be like he's stressed. Yeah. You go to the talk, they do like this. They they sweat. Yeah, they Recent time they off in mic. <laughs> that is why I am saying that you see, you can't you can't employ someone like that because looking at him on the touchline self, bro, there's there's no hope. Because a coach there, ah, you, you went to a battle, you lost. You for calm the situations, you understand? Because you be the point of reference, exactly. you be the point of contact. You for lead your pack. Bro, he's all over the place. As then they ask him, like, <laughs> I don't know why he be, I'm sure he's hyperactive, you understand? <laughs> Maybe he's hyperactive. That is why he always he always they behave like that. But because <laughs> What the hell? No, all right, zero all right. As a coach, the zero all right. Ah. Uh, the ask come say, uh -huh. are you going to resign? No, this is this is reply. I will not resign, no matter how bad things get. I won't leave. I'll fight and make sure things get better. Who told him things are going to get better? Ah, uh, he said things will get better. <laughs> okay, well. So he said for resign, if you think he's going to resign, it's never going to happen. Wait, the, the, this in the World Cup, was he not about to resign or something before he was sacked? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I be saying he for go back to his family. Yeah, that's before. what happened. So I don't know why. But he... I said this one, they once he be determined, say he go make you Ghana see, better. Me. Listen, you see, <laughs> you say a grow so if run up. If play go be he start from on the team. If he be coach where he show some you know, signs and symptoms say, oh, it will be better. Me, I don't have a problem. We've given him the job twice. Yeah. Like two times. All the times that we appointed him as the head coach of the the most significant national team in this country, you know, he performed abysmally. Yeah. You understand? And so, and there, bro, there is no clear cut path or plan for where the Black Stars is heading towards. So what he is sitting there and, and telling us, it'd be nonsensical to me. Because it's not like he has a plan. How is he going to fix the Black Star situation? 
We have uh, we have World Cup qualifiers. From now to our first match for the qualifiers, you know, what is he going to do? We've seen it before. Get rid of this man. He is not going to impact the Black Stars. He is, tact he is tactless. He is visionless. He is clueless. As a coach, bro, he is oraless. Get rid of him. Get Put him aside. Bro, we hire to fire. True. We, we don't hire, hire to, to fire. To we don't hire to pamper. No, we no, hire no, to no, fire. fire. Get rid of him. We ain't to quack. How this team be issue? I think the GFA team will meet next week. So yes, yeah. all the people who are... Really? The funny thing is that the GFA will meet next week. The For what? Members, the people who are failed are going to meet to decide on what they should do. Failures are meeting. Are, are meeting. The problems are going to meet, meet. problems to discuss the problems, problems they are facing. How? The ministry is meeting GFA and GFA is meeting the, uh, the, the, you know, the that's coach. That's why they do why they happy now. We just, the, it's like the community and the meetings, they beat them. Like. See, no As you no said, the, 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 the problem, problem is going to meet problems problem to discuss, discuss the problem. problem. <laughs> when the problem is in the room. <laughs> like, you are the problem. Ready. How? We are so clueless as oh. a country that we can't even get the basics right. Football, we have failed as a country. Hmm. This is what you are going to meet. What, what is going to be the outcome of that meeting? Mm -hmm. Bro, head, the decision can be taken today. Bro, head, uh, I, as you say, you tweet, say nobody has been sacked. Sack. They don't sack anybody no. yet. And Otowado, you see, Otowado, you see, when, when he came back, the second <laughs> appointment, you know, he told the, um, the Dortmund people that he has quit. Yeah, yeah, Usually the first one, he was doing Boha yeah, yeah, yeah. He was doing Lokum. Then Rentam. Right now, he, you know he quit before he was given the job. Yeah. So right now, if then sack him or he resigned from the Black Stars, yeah. unless the Tiatim Poe FC will employ him. No game, no. So he's trying to save his job. It, 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 you know what they mean? He get plans for the Black Stars. Mm -hmm. I can assure you that the subsequent matches, Otoado is not going to perform. And we'll come and sit here and we'll, bro, I don't hate Otoado. But the thing is, we hire to fire. We hire for uh, what? People to deliver. Exactly. If they are not delivering this move. is what has uh you know oh you know bedeviled the country when we put people in positions of power and they are not performing it's like we are pampering them how, yeah. how bro Man Man find somebody or me coachless make, make the players now coach themselves because we, the, the reported amount they say they take for uh, uh, fifty thousand dollars how hmm. bro let him go it is not by force co co Nipa be yebi wa be yeni na. But what are people saying oh, about that? Um, no, I, but I, I before we go go mm -hmm. to that, um, the former coach of the Blaster, CK Akuno. Nwai Akuno. Yes, he grants an interview mm -hmm. where he has said a lot of things about the GFE. Mm -hmm. And one issue where every Ghanaian they always talk about has to do with selection. Say they don't allow the coach to do a selection. GFE they interfere or the board they interfere. Mm -hmm. This is from CK Akuno. As a coach. You make the list based on your tactical plans, but the GFA and other stakeholders often have their own views and who should be in the squad. It wasn't or it wasn't always a smooth process. So mm -hmm. CK Akuno say the selection since he was a coach, the stakeholders go fi come see Charlie for guy wish him. Mm. The GFA to go come for wish him. Sports ministry go come for wish him. You know, Kets they own five football clubs yeah. across the divisions uh, in the country. Exactly. He owns five, five, <laughs> one, two, three, four, five <laughs> football clubs. In our like in our football divisions, various divisions. <laughs> that is the head of our football. Like that is the uh, um the Ghana Football Association president. He owns five. This will be a player. Be exactly. Be. That's the thing. Interference from people who don't have technical knowledge about how players because should be. Not a player you understand? Mm. And that is why we will always fail because if you are not going to give room for the coach to operate, there's no point. Mm. I the coach, as as he said, based on my tactics, I will need this, I will need this, I will need that. But because somebody we have heard stories where people take money to field players, they, they share what they are bonuses. Yeah. It is sad. They have monetized the black stars. Instead of productizing it, they have monetized it. <laughs> so it is money, money. Once again, I am putting this thing out there again that the black stars of Ghana should work and pay themselves. Exactly. When they go and play and they give them money, they should share it among themselves. No sensible government should give them money to operate. When you win tournament, they make so money. much money for us to be giving them to be passing money, to be flying money to them. Yeah, it is a waste of uh, state, state resources. resources. Sit them down, tell them that the sponsors, one Jesse, they have about 20 sponsors. Yeah. Their training kit has about 10 Five sponsors. Billion. Take money from them and fix your, your uh, the black stars. We don't have to pay them. We don't have to give them bonuses. They don't even, they are not, they don't even deserve they, it. They don't deserve the bonuses. Nonsense. Prophet Kumchacha. Is it? Yes, this morning at Angel TV. Or see or no? What he used to watch Ghana game, he go watch Puno. 
understandable. He go pick Pono. I don't I don't promote. Over. We are not going to sit this here. This time right there, I will promote him. No, 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 no. We can't do that. If it's Ghana football. I understand where it's Michel Pono. Charlie and Kalani Shane before we for cut Man of God, <laughs> bar for Pono. You bar. Charlie. Charlie. You how it means bad. how bad and how horrible, how terrible the Black Stars as a team they have become. <laughs> and it's sad. But you see, it's understandable. Yesterday, you saw the numbers. Yeah. Bro, when the the ones that even went there, they were cheering for um, yes, the Ni- Nigerians. Penalty, Ghanians, yeah. they shout, are we? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are we? Yeah. It tells you that nobody. Now, but one thing, what, what, you see, listen, the Kudus situation. Eh, I feel like, um, first of all, Kudus in um, various matches for the Black Stars recently, he has not put out the performance. Yeah. But proud to this thing happening, Kudus gave us like you know he put smiles on people in their faces when we went to the World Cup. We've seen him performance. So, bro, we are going through it right now. Players, no, Omasa. Coaches, you know, so, so I don't know what they are doing. But then to subject him to that kind of treatment, I feel like it'd be extreme, you understand? For the reaction from the fans, it not be just for Kudus. They, they do for everyone. But if Kudus was coming to play penalty, yeah. and you are shouting, you ask Ghani, you are shouting away, 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 away. The honest truth is that Ghanians are more frustrated than even the players. Yeah, the I teams. understand. But you see, that's the thing. That is, this is where we they push some of our players out from the Black Stars. You remember that man of God coming out to say that Kudus, Kudus is going do. to... Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I that, don't that's, want him, that's what I have here. Yeah, yes. I don't want him to tender his resignation. But I feel like, bro, no, I am not saying so don't criticize him. But I feel like to the extreme of like all these things, bro, you want to, you want to sit here and tell me, say, Kudus, has never done anything for the black stars. Mm-hmm. Oh, he has done a lot. Bro, there Even were the times that we needed him against Egypt. Yes, and he, he stepped out. Two goals. Yeah. So today, where he the shame, I'm not once again. I'm not saying me and Gasan. Uh, yesterday we did a video bashing. The shame no be for Kudus alone. No, but it's so like he's been, be like general for the whole. Let, team. Let's be honest. He's been targeted. Yes, he has been targeted on social media on other platforms. Once again, I'm not saying that. I don't criticize Kudus. Kudus is not about reproach. Yeah. And Kudus is not the first Black Stars player. But you see, we they carry the go. And you see, we are trying to, uh, bro, play so much shit. But at the end of the day, we, we go first sit here and say whatever we want to say. At the end of the day, we'll play the football. True. Cut them some slack and let them go out there and, bro, re-strategize and come, and back. come back. But you see, the personal attacks and the brand endorsements that he has and Akivo Gary, this kid, bro, you know the need. Even for Kudus, there is a Twitter account with the name impersonating Kudus him, Muhammad. yeah, it's not him. He, oh, no, no, Kedjegun. I think Kudus, yeah, yeah, yeah. He the post, post them. The name is Mohammed Kudus, yeah, yeah. He's still. Anytime Kudus play mad, no, she be yeah, yeah, you can't post him. Yeah, picture. yeah, yeah. And Kudus see, for work on that's that. the thing when he posts like that, people think it is Kudus, then, then they go attacking him and turns. You, are, you see, bro, what I'm saying is, bro, Kudus has done something for Ghana, he hmm. has played for Ghana. There were times that we needed him that he turned up right now. They either she, she, or no, born in Sweeney. But you know they mean say you know go fit you know re-strategize then come back cut them some slack the overdragging no go work we we saw what overdragging did, did to us some more giant things but fine I'm not here I'm not going to sit here and dictate to you how you for drag somebody or not I feel like the way they carry go because brand endorsement or you get or you are dragging the brands inside for what for what exactly born in Okobo and any year he will get found me. no born in born in born in you know you know play him well <laughs> they do score penalty you easy you. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. I feel like Charlie, listen. <laughs> but then you see, as you people they switch sides, make you people stay there. Oh. Yeah. Switch the side and stay there. Perform for World Cup. Oh, me, I don't want to hear anything. It's my crash. No problem. Uh-huh. Crashes. Crash, hey, right now, yeah. crashes. Crab no problem. Me see, when you switch sides, stay there. When he start performing uh, better or good, now make you no know, come back. That more trouble. You know, me and Casa no new friends. Me and Casa are gatekeep. Exactly. So if you are switching, switch today. Media kudus need yes for life. But here I'm in my bed snack. Any kind of kudus pass the ball, release the ball. Any yeah. pass, release the release ball. the ball. Yes. I know they mean yeah, I can't that. But yeah. at the end of the day, I have seen kudus perform for the black star. We have all seen. He's a good player. It just be a, a phase or a stage they go through. Him. So maybe I will just put it out there and make you people calm down small. But if you want to overdo him to her, feel Carry free. I think kudus nankasa be mentally strong to you know accommodate some of these things. Yeah. But at the end of the day, that account with them impersonate them in team for make sure say them quench them. Yeah, Honestly, so yeah. gum like there are some posts you go. I yesterday I saw the person. Mm. <sighs> Where was the name of kudus yeah. Muhammad? That be the name. Pe- 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 kudus I'm Muhammad. going the prayer this day. No, you get like eleven k for. Yeah, nah, this is not kudus. Bro, Match you know, know about. Well, 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 you can't post. Then Daniel's vexed for the comments. Oh. Charlie, anyway, but o- anyway, that's the Kudus situation. Official situ. A coach who runs to celebrate an equalizer on the pitch against Niger in Ghana. 
doesn't understand the assignment. His standards aren't great. Heck, this was an equalizer against Niger in a pointless game. If I'm a player looking at him, I'm like, who is this guy? That's what I'm saying. If I'm this... a player, let me tell you, how I see you. Exactly. That's why I said that if he's your coach and you're a player playing near a show, that's all shame anymore. You will be disappointed. Bro, you see Don Carlo before. Madrid, Nasty Ash. He the win, that. bro. Oh, you know what I'm saying? No, Rezi, I brown. No. Coach, there are coaches and there is coaches. Cockroaches. cockroaches. Mm -hmm. There are coaches and there are cockroaches. cockroaches. Bro, Some don't just play. Carlo, no, oh, uh, eh? Pep, cry now, you're animated. Eh? Pep, self, no, the wrong go feel top. For equalizer in a game that you have lost. Pep, go, the top to chair and things. Yes. When I could hear nothing, he just, they talk Wash to Kaftan. Kaftan. How, bro? <laughs> hey, shout out to my nigga Taylor Marek. We are not, yes, invite Ope Kaftan and contact Taylor Marek, bro. True. That's my guy. Sadik Adams, Pep Guardiola as head coach of Ghana with Hansi Flick as technical director who struggled to win games under the prevailing con conditions. What are the prevailing conditions? It means that the, the people have don't want to blame Otuado. They want to blame the whole uh, football. Okay. Because people feel like the structures or the measures we are not in place. Them. So even if we bring Pep Guardiola to coach Ghana Blasters, mm -hmm. we we'll still see the same thing. And so, for I also believe that. Mm -hmm. But at least they will do better than what Otuado is so doing. So Scanty, if the prevailing conditions are structures, we don't have structures. We we there is no harmony. There is nothing. It's like for, for Koba. That is why we appointed people, we voted people to be in these positions so that they can help fix it, right? There is a problem. We identify the problem. We vote people into power to fix it. If the people are not fixing it, that was say Akufuado. Akufuado has the uh, um, you know the time to do like the funniest thing by interfering. In our and football. everybody will be happy. This interference, man. I mean, even if FIFA come inside, we will accept it. Fire everybody. Step inside, but now let us for the fly left. Right this be what if you do save Ghanaians? Exactly. We say forget. FIFA step inside, they step no political interference. This one they will back you. No more make them, all of them. We. because the more we go, the more we don't. It perform. is the government that is paying you. But when you go out, uh, you, when you go underperform, the government for keep quiet. Huh. FIFA and Angas and Yan No, because no, I'm, I'm, yeah, because honestly, let me let, let's 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 understand it. The government they pay them, government they pay um. The GFA. Yeah. Government, they pay, they do they pay the players. When they go uh, underperform, government for not talk. Yeah. But the government money, they won't take. Government interference, sometimes they worry. Why? Money no be interference. Dictatorship, maybe like... No, no. Pay. It's money not an interference. Money is. Okay, so, so what? that is what I'm saying. Let the football club now, let the football team run itself. Yeah. So that the government will not in, uh, 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 what influence anything. It's Mukona Mukushia, then you fix your own problem. But so long as the government is dishing out money like 8.5 million for these people to go and waste. The government has every right to interfere. FIFA and Angas, I was here. I can't do this. Infantine, infantine, whatever. Infantine, infantine. Infantine. We foresee, well, because, and a government, do you know what 8.5 million uh, can do for our country? Be small money. Yeah, so if government is giving you 8.5 million and you are not performing, government for not talk. The, the government, um, the president of the land can fire the sports minister. Fire him! But that interference all the way to the GFA be like too extreme. You know what? If, okay. So if we make the sports minister fire the GFA, a, a, they hit you go fire him. Simple, Juma. That be out. Yes. They hit to fire December, him. then fire him. Yeah. Yeah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> December, hit to then go fire him. Hit to then go fire him. No, be a coffee. Okay. That be all. Mm. So they just will do the process. But I don't know what they go sit down. I think 29th or 20th. Then, then, then. Man, I don't know what this shit they have to crazy, take. Man. Mm. Shit. Felix, in any serious country, by 8 p.m. this evening, the FA president will resign. The ESCO will also be dissolved. Blasters management committee will be dissolved. Otwadro and his backroom staff will be sacked. Mm. But hey, this is Ghana. This is Ghana. Things this never would change. Yeah. <clears throat> Sadiq Adams again. Niger has beaten Ghana at home. 2-1. Six games, no win for Ghana. Mm. No AFCON for Ghana. No FA president should survive this. No blaster chairman will survive this. Mm. No coach and no technical team will survive this. Darkest period in Ghana's football. <clears throat> we have another Samuel Amano. Otuado will eventually get it right to lead Ghana and conquer Africa again and again. Conquer which Africa? Yes, we shall conquer. Also, very really changes. Let's be serious. Fentu. Um... Otuado is like Ten Hag in a lot of ways. Mm. First up, their press conferences are more annoying than the actual performances. Mm. Yes. Oppressy, six group games and Ghana couldn't even win one game. Wow. Mm. If GFA members are still employed by the end of this month, I would really be shocked. Mm. Iron Boy tagged His Excellency the President said, Mr. 
Go blasters ni GFE and Sana Wako. Guno. Mm. Kamali, the last time Ghana failed to make Afcon, I wasn't even born. Everybody at the GFA needs to resign immediately. Mm. The king Ajo, we need a new GFA president. We need to save our football. This we have said over and over again, but the disgrace is too much. Kent. Eli mm. Sewa, I don't understand why GFA sagu to Ado only to bring him back to coach Blasters mm. again. Dear FIFA, ban Ghana teams from football for at least 15 years. Mm. You can call us ba back by 2040. By that <laughs> time, we may be ready. We need to channel the country's resources to be to somewhere else. Letter from Ghanaians. Mm. So it goes on and on in the comment section. Uli Linsua, Canada. You don't need to get it. We played against Angola, Sudan, Niger, all the way at home and away and insecure a single win. Mm. Otwado, you have blood in your hands. This is mm. from this is from Kate. This is for, from his Facebook page after the, the loss yesterday. This is what he wrote. <laughs> from the highest heights of world football on the 29th of March 2022 to the lowest ebb of Afcon qualifying matches. My heart bleeds. <laughs> Definitely, this is not what we want or what we bargain for. Mm. At this point, only cool heads can win, and can we, and we uh, can win, and we as leaders of our sport will stay together, be honest with ourselves, and fix it, this problem. The road to full recovery after normalization is definitely bumpy and rough, but our collective efforts and patience will win, and Ghana will win, and Ghana, our beloved country, will win. As a Black Star fan and as a leader, I share in your pain and in our pain. We will rise from the temporary st setback. It shall be well. This is from Kate. That's your football association. <laughs> <laughs> well, we will rise you we have you supervised two tournaments that we have been to and we, we came out of the group stage. Is it today? If we will fix things, it be now. You know, be serious. You see, Kate, Jordan, man, from now, we go play um, Chad in March 2025. Mm -hmm. From now to that time, just watch. You won't hear anything. They won't put any measures in place. No preparations. March 10th, mm. they will bring another lineup. Exactly. Play. That's what I'm saying. So if we rise again, you mm. start they do the work. Then the rise will get even more to Jimmy. <laughs> um, to no to to Jimmy rise, they talk because about. there's nothing you can do. And then you know what to me. And you it's hard to Just go. Now the FA president, they Adriani. You know, can't do the job. It's like you are begging to serve someone. You say, oh, make, make you no we serve say leave. Oh. oh, we are saying, well, in my head, everything he touches, bless Oh, my Leave my the God. job God. and go home. I'm going to probably win tonight. I'm going to probably win tonight. LDA. Anyway. And I will support the club. Now, club, club, club. Now, club. Now, now, but I'm going to club, club, so I need to beat you. Anyway. And I do club, B.A. I know how to say, B.A. How? All right, Scanty. So, yes, um... Mm. Did he? Did he say yeah, send yeah, food yeah. to your loved ones? Yeah. Send the food blaster to players made them chop yeah, some. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Then we left Moro. Yeah. They are done. They have come back to disgrace us. Their time is up. They, and they are going. No responsibility. Nothing. nothing. I've not seen any apology from the players yet. Mm. I don't know what did they wait for, but mm. at least I don't know. We said we don't even have captain. Maybe it will come. It will come in. It will come in. They want to leave before they bring of it. Of course, I'll be, be apology. We think we don't get boy. captain safe. Anyway, so yes, did this say send uh you know other food for your loved ones? Make you know make some guy go order food for your woman, then take uh you know what take them from you. So log on to www.ddjolove.store. Order food for your loved ones. If anywhere you day, anywhere you day, you go feed the US and order food through the website, then they will go deliver to your loved ones. Not from the boys' side alone, the girls to order food for your loved ones. Love is not one-sided, it's two-sided. So, ladies and gentlemen, once again, the website is www.ddjolove.store. Other food and yes, you know you, the food here, bro, crazy. Where you can kill rice, everything, love, meat, bro. pork meat, everything they there. Once grilled the chicken. Oh, shouts to Didi Jolof. Yeah, yeah. Black stars there. Yeah, 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 yeah